It's been said that the Psalms are the language of the soul. The Psalms are full of prayers, thoughts, and emotions that are poetically written to express the deepest needs in the human heart. Psalm 139 is one of the most eloquently written chapters in Scripture to express the fact that God is all-seeing, all-knowing, all-powerful, and everywhere present. God knows us much better than we know ourselves, and God is with us. His greatest gift to us is the opportunity to know Him. He offers this to us through His Son, Jesus Christ, who has all authority in heaven and on earth to forgive sin and place us in right standing with God. In the final two verses of Psalm 139, it says, Search me, O God, and know my heart. Test me and know my anxious thoughts. Point out anything in me that offends you and lead me along the path of everlasting life. As believers, we have the privilege of knowing God and following Him along the path of everlasting life. By His grace, we possess the greatest gift ever given, the forgiveness of sins and eternal life in Jesus. If you recall the paralytic who was lowered through the roof by his friends in hopes to receive healing from Jesus in Mark chapter 2, Mark chapter 2 verse 5 says, When Jesus saw their faith, he said to the paralyzed man, Son, your sins are forgiven. But wait, his friends might have said, he needs healing in his body, not forgiveness of sins. But you see, Jesus knows our greatest need, and he dealt with the issue of sin before he addressed his physical need. What good would it have been for this man to have two whole legs and walk right into hell with him? Whenever there's a problem, almost always sin is the real problem. Jesus got right to the problem. So in Psalm 139 verse 24, for King David to speak from the heart and ask God to point out anything in him that offends God, he's revealing his greatest need. And here's the bottom line. Forgiveness of sins is the greatest miracle Jesus ever performs. Take joy in that great truth today Meditate on the words of these psalms and enjoy time with Him along the path of everlasting life.